Yeah. <laughs> what up? Welcome back to another video, guys. I've had these leather pros here for some time now, and I've been able to stuff them up with quite a few things um, in the last few months that I've had them, and I've been taking them on quite a little few little journeys here and there. So I can finally talk about if they are actually worth the big price point because yes, these bags are um, at a high price point. Um, and today we're gonna talk about if it's worth it, what can it contain inside, how good are they, and quality build and everything else. So with that being said, let's just hop into it. Now let's talk about quality real quick. On the top here, you're gonna have this nice hard leather on top, which complements the bike really nice. It complements the seat right here. Um, and the overall shape of the bike. Now, due to the bike you're gonna have, this shape of the bag is also gonna change because uh, if you want it for your 2020 Lowrider S, which I want to pair for my uh, bike, um, it's gonna be shaped a bit differently. Um, obviously for the Dyna, it's different because it has the exposed shocks right here and it needs to be angled in a different way. Um, so they're all gonna look a bit different. Uh, these look really nice. These might be like my favorite design, the way they look on the Dynas. Just because of the way it's angled, it's really nice. Um, gives it a nice character as well. And it just, you know, you, you, you still have that exposed look of, you know, of the rear shock. But some of you guys spend a lot of money on these rear shocks and you kind of like want to show them off and see what you have. So that's, <laughs> that's also a big plus. Um, as far as compartment, it's amazing because you're able to open this up on top. You have your big main compartment inside right here. And then on the side, you're gonna have this little pocket, which is not that little because you can actually fit a lot. I mostly use this a lot because most of the time when I'm out there riding, I just wanna chuck in a few things. Um, my keys, my wallet, if I wanna carry some snacks, I just chuck them in here. Um, if I'm on the road for a little bit longer and I wanna change and I wanna bring a change of clothes, um, I mainly tend to use the bigger pocket. Um, I gotta be honest with you, I've mainly used these bags mainly to go shopping. I'll go to the supermarket, I'll do my groceries, and I'll pack literally everything in these bulk bags because the space is amazing. Uh, it expands out. I'll show you in a few minutes exactly how much it, uh, it expands out. Um, but you're really able to carry a lot of stuff in there. Um, yeah, believe it or not, you are able to fit more stuff in these bags than you're able to fit in the bags of, let's say, a Rogue Glide, a Rogue King, or a Street Glide. You're gonna have a lot more ample space in here. Now, through this whole little journey of being having these bags, one of my favorite things about these bags is how easy they are to detach from your bike. So if you ever just want a clean look on your bike, you don't wanna worry about using tools to take these bags off or whatnot. These are very, very simple um, to just take off. And even if you are on a trip, let's say I'm taking a trip, you know, out of state and I'm packing all my stuff in there. After I get to my destination, I'm literally able to just uplift my bags and walk into my hotel, wherever I'm staying at and use my bags as my, my carry on luggage, which is amazing. Now, one thing you might notice that I'm not too crazy about is that these buttons sometimes on top, they are a bit hard to take off, right? So I'm going to open this bag up here. I'm gonna twist my key knob on the inside, which allows me to lock my bag. So this key right here allows me to lock or unlock it. I just used my latch on top. While it's down all the way up. And now I'm able to easily access my bags. That's awesome. Like that's that's like a, a big, big plus for me. It just it's so awesome the fact that you're just able to do that. And then to put it back on, just put it over. Then you just lock it back up and you're all set. Now you do have this big, huge compartment in there. Now you're also gonna have this secondary zipper right here, which is gonna allow you to even stretch out even more. So once you fill it up, if you want more space, you're able to do this, stretches out, you're able to fit more of your belongings in there. Amazing for those, you know, if any of you guys are planning to take those super long trips, we'll just close this back up and show you what it looks like close up back again. So small space right there and like I said mentioned before on the side pocket you're able to fit a lot of stuff in there which is great now the price point for the dino bags are gonna run you what the hell are gonna run you around six hundred dollars I know for the 2020 low ride arse it might be a bit cheaper uh, depending on what bike you have the price is gonna vary um, but if you ask me today is the price worth it 
I'm just gonna tell you like my main man Stone Cold. Give me a hell yeah! Yes, they're worth every little single penny you're gonna drop into these bags, man. You're able to take them off, they're good quality, the nylon material is really strong, nice leather on top, um, and then you have that nice bracket in the bottom which protects it. Um, I almost, I'm also running this TBR right here on the side, which, you know, TBRs get really hot. Um, it has not done any damage to the bracket, and it has not done any damage to the bag on top either, which is a plus, so you don't really got to worry about messing up your, you know, expensive, nice bags. Um, pricey, but they're worth it. Beautiful design. You're able to do so much with it. You're able to pack anything, pretty much everything in there. And uh, that's pretty much it. I'm going to give these bags a two thumbs up, or... If I had five stars, I would give it five stars. Like a five out of five. So yeah, that's gonna be it guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new to my channel, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell button. That's gonna notify you anytime I upload any type of new content. And a huge, huge, huge shout out to Leather Pros, man. Amazing product. I'm gonna catch you guys to the next one. Like always, let the force be with you. Ride safe. And enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.